It is my pleasure to introduce Dr. Tony Nader. We used to say Maharaja, the 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 Maharshi Mahesh Yogi Ji, like that. Walai, Vishnu ko Vaidik Maharaja, tokno bhai ko saro walai ki Rigved Mahati tholo anusandan gornu bhai ko kura mile agi jankari karai. Walai ko sanship ko kare bai data maya kare rasuna aur saansho tar jo Angrezi ma sa Tony Nader, MD, PhD, M. Maharaja, MIT and Harvard, trained medical doctor, neuroscientist, and one of the world great Vedic scholar. His training includes internal medicine, psycho, uh, 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 psych, psychiatry, and neurology, with a PhD in brain and uh, cognitive science from the Massachusetts Institute of Technology, MIT. Introduced to Ayurveda and other areas of Vedic knowledge by Maharishi, who guided him, his training under the most renowned Vedic scholar. He, into, he conducted pioneering research on Ayurveda Rasayana, trained thousands of doctors in Ayurveda and modality of Ayurveda called self pulse. For years, Dr. Nader worked closely with Maharishi and successfully corrected, collected correlated each aspects of the Vedic literature to a specific area of human psychology and anatomy, anatomy as well as the cell and the DNA with the conclusion the human physiology is the expression of Veda and the Vedic literature. All published in five books, plus the <clears throat> Ramayana in Human Physiology, which extended his profound scientific uh, elaboration of the uh, scientific significance of Veda. Maharishi appointed Dr. Nader as his successor. He, he is head of the International Transcendental Meditation Organization in over 100 countries and guided, guides the TM program and its practical application to improve all areas of society, education, health, defense, business, and more. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, would like to kindly request Maharaja Dr. Tony Nader to deliver your um, address to the great gathering out here in Nepal. Dr. Tony Nader, please. Jai Gurudev, Maharaja. I don't think it's working. I hear you well. Oh, yes, we hear you now. So you haven't... I should start over? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> yes go ahead. Please start over. Okay. Greetings to everyone and uh, great respects to Her Excellency uh, Vidya Devi Bandari and gratitude to her presence today, her nourishing power from the land of Nepal, which is the land of Janaka and Janaki, the land of Sita, Mother Divine, the land of Veda also, and Vedic literature, the land of the Pandits, and great land of knowledge that Maharishi has loved and has seen as a shining light for the whole world, and now under the auspices of Sri Vidya Devi Bandari, we can see the power of motherhood, the power of parental role to bless the whole world in a nourishing way. 
and with this great assembly and the great organizers that I want to thank and to whom I send all the support from all the 191 countries of the world where our organization is present and spreading this knowledge and thank them, thank you, uh, Deepak Ji and all our great leaders from the international activities for organizing this because this knowledge that we have, that we are discussing and that will be brought to light during this conference is a very profound scientific knowledge, a knowledge of life on the most basic level from the most subtle, the most abstract level of pure spirituality, pure being, all the way to the very gross level of the physical material life. We have a knowledge that has been bestowed upon us from the Vedic tradition where Nepal is a great leader and a great custodian and now enlivened in this scientific way we can see its significance as has been discussed already today and will be discussed in greater details as we go on with the conference has a very great significance for every aspect of life to be fully developed so that individual consciousness, individual potential, individual mind and body, physiology and behavior, and on the level of society and whole nations, we can have a knowledge that brings fulfillment to the individual and invincibility to every society. And that is the inheritance, that is the reality of what Nepal has and what Nepal can offer, as Marshi has seen in Nepal, a shining, nourishing light for the whole world. This knowledge has a theoretical part, which is complete and is in accordance with the modern discoveries in all fields. It has a practical part, an application part, which is very systematic, which is very reliable and repeatable and therefore scientifically applicable, And therefore, like any other science, the science of engineering that creates cars and airplanes and allows people to travel in a comfortable and faster way, this is also a science and therefore it is applicable for all people, for all belief systems, for all ways of life and allows every aspect of life to blossom in wholeness, in totality, in fullness. So it is material and spiritual, it is physical and intellectual, it is psychological, philosophical, but very practical and very applied to all levels of the material expressions and the non-material subtle levels of awareness and consciousness. I congratulate everyone and thank you for gathering together. The knowledge will be expounded in great way in the able presence of great scientists and leaders of the world that are present this day and it's my great honor and pleasure to have been connected to you and to follow the proceedings of this great gathering. Thank you all for organizing and we look forward for Nepal to lead the world in wholeness, fullness and perfection based on the deep knowledge that Nepal has and that Nepal is now expanding and promoting and sharing with our entire family of nations. All glory to the teachers. All glory to Marshi and Gurudev and the teachers of the Vedic tradition.
and to all the leaders of Nepal and great humble loving respects to her excellency Shri Vidya Devi Bandari Jai Gurudev